As we continue our virtual learning journeys, many of us miss the perks that come with physically attending school every day, like after school clubs and sports. When it comes to the drama club, they aren't letting anything get in their way to eventually perform their spring musical, The Little Mermaid. Members of the club have been attending Zoom meetings to rehearse for their upcoming production that will be happening once the pandemic clears. I had the opportunity to speak to two of the leads in the play, Mark Huggins and Mia Preziosi, to see how they feel about this new digitized way of practicing for their show. Hey guys, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with me today. Thank you for having us. So what are your guys' roles this year in the play? Well, I'm Ariel. Uh, and I'm Prince Eric. So what are some of the positives to virtually practicing? Well, when we're all together, um, it's sort of like a, we're constantly checking in, um, practicing and performing for each other. So it's nice to be able to have some time in between practices to just like kind of perfect what you're doing and then be able to show it to the, to the rest of the group. Yeah, it gives us a way to connect. Like we usually do connect as a family every year, but um, since we can't be together, it gives us a way to continue to feel that bond, that camaraderie, and then we can go and perform at our very best once we get back to school. So how do you guys think the show is going to be this year, even though you haven't had much time to physically practice with your peers? Well, when, we are, when we're all allowed to see each other again uh, after quarantine, we are gonna have a few weeks of, of physical practice together. So all the work that we've done at home, we'll be able to put together and sort of perfect as a group on stage after. Yeah, like all the virtual runs and like song rehearsals that we've done here, they're gonna get us ahead for when we get back. So we'll be extra prepared and then we'll have had all this time to get ready now. So it'll just be built on the physical rehearsals that we do have. So how does a normal Zoom call go down? Well, um, we'll go into the Zoom at like a scheduled time, like normal rehearsals would be just, you know, later at night or whenever. Then we make sure that everybody who's supposed to be in the call is there, whether it's a full cast or like leads or certain leads, like we make sure that everybody's there. And then our directors tell us what we're going to do, whether we're going to run certain scenes or start from act one or act two. Um, or it'll be a singing rehearsal and we'll be told what songs we're gonna run, we'll mute ourselves and we'll sing with the music so that we know what we're doing. And then if we're doing like a full show run, we'll read through the scenes, we'll play the songs, and our set designer will show, will share his screen and show us the 3D models of what our set is supposed to look like. What is your favorite part of the virtual Zoom practices? Um, I'd say a really big is um, being able to, our set designer will, will project the set onto the screen, he'll share it. And so while we're running a scene, we'll be able to actually look at like what we're gonna be on, uh, what we're gonna be doing on the set. Um, and it just kind of allows that sort of view that we never got in, in a physical practice. Um, as you can see, all of the theater students are working extremely hard to produce the best show possible for the Passaic Valley community. We look forward to seeing the final product once COVID-19 becomes more contained. Make sure you keep updated with PVHS social media to be informed on updates on the show.